In this video, I will show you the top 10 things to do in London. Welcome to Ricky's in London. Here are the top 10 things to do in London. Number 10 is Big Ben and the Parliament of Westminster. The Big Ben clock tower was completed in 1859. The official name of the tower in which Big Ben is located was originally the clock tower and was officially renamed to Elizabeth Tower in 2012. Did you know that Big Ben charms every hour and every 15 minutes smaller bells charms to indicate quarter hour. The Big Ben charms can be heard up to 5 miles away. Just a few steps away, you will also find Westminster Abbey, where the coronation happened. This former industrial economic base has been replaced by a service industry such as retail, tourist and entertainment. The area now owes street markets and music venues. Candom Market which got its name from what used to be a horse stable and a hospital located right next to Candom Lock. Do not skip the Candom Market busy streets. There are so many markets over here, you will surely be surprised. Number 8 is Museums. London is full of incredible museums and most of them are free. This is British Museum founded in the mid 19th century. The museum is dedicated to human history, art and culture. Did you know that it also displays the famous Rosetto Stone? Continuing to the beautiful 19th century Natural History Museum, exhibiting a vast range of specimens from various segments of natural history, and you can also embark on other fun and education adventure. You will also see the Science Museum just around the corner, a great place to see touch and experience science. Of course, there are many other museums in central London. Don't forget to visit them. Number 7 is Convent Garden. It is a car-free area next to the Royal Opera House. Filled with luxury designer shops. This is a great place to spend your time. There are many bars, restaurants and theatres over here. The Convent Garden opened in 1845. You can also visit Jubilee Market which sells lots of antique stuff. Number 6 is London Eye. London Eye is a giant ferris wheel on the south bank of River Thames. London Eye overlooks Big Ben and Westminster. When it opened to the public in the year 2000, it was the world's tallest ferris wheel. The structure is 443 feet or 135 meters tall and the wheel has a diameter of 394 feet or 120 meters. London is full of other impressive views. It's a beautiful view from the Shard or the Sky Garden. Number 5 is Little Venice. Little Venice is a neighborhood created on a decorative houseboats and a party tree lined three-way junctions of canals. Little Venice is one of London's prime resident area and contains of restaurants, shops, theatres and pubs. A beautiful sight and something that you will not accept to see in London. If you have time, explore the nearby Paddington base with floating pocket parks. Number 4 is Buckingham Palace. Buckingham Palace is the most iconic royal building in the UK. It is the royal residence of King Charles and is one of the only a few working royal palace left in the world. Don't miss the iconic ceremony of changing the guards, also known as guard mounting, carried out by soldiers on active duty from the foot guards. They have guarded the royal palace since 1660. Number 3 is Oxford Street from the high-end department stores. London is a shopper's paradise. Oxford Street is the one of the best shopping streets in the world and the best toy shops. Once you cross Piccadilly Circus, just continue straight and you will find Soho. Soho has a unique shopping experience. 
just inside of so you will find Chinatown and if you're next to this area make sure to visit Regent Street number two is Parks and Gardens Hyde Park and Kensington Palace there are many impressive green areas in London worth exploring Hyde Park is London's main park offering the world-class events and concerts and plenty of quiet places to relax. You can walk around Princess Diana Memorial Fountain or you can rent a boat to paddle around. This is a great place to have a nice picnic. Don't skip the nearby Kensington Palace. Don't forget to visit Regent Park and some number of small parks around Westminster. You will surely love them. Number one is Tower Bridge. Tower Bridge crosses the River Thames and was built at the end of 19th century. You can even take a boat ride that goes under the Tower Bridge. Don't miss the many attractions nearby. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Please do like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.